Boys and girls, welcome to this week's BSF. It is around Thanksgiving time. Are you looking forward to the holidays? God is our provider. God gave us His precious words, and God's words are true. Let's get ready for today's Bible lesson. Have you seen the stars in the sky? Let's do a finger play about the stars. Twinkling stars shine above. They tell me of God's love. Okay, so boys and girls, sit on your bottom, zip your mouth, feet still, hands in your lap, your eyes on me. God is listening. God is listening to each word I say. He will hear me. He will hear me. Every time I pray, our hands we fold, our heads we bow, so we can talk to God just now. God, thank you for being our provider and taking care of us. Please help us to learn the Bible lesson today. In Jesus' name, Amen. God is provider. God gave His people everything they need to obey Him. Abram and Sarai did not have a child. They waited for a long time. This made them very sad. God saw how sad Abram and Sarai were. One night, God talked to Abram. God told Abram he would have a son. God told, took Abram outside and showed him all the stars in the sky. God told Abram that he would have many grandchildren and great grandchildren, as many as the stars in the sky. God encouraged Abram and gave Abram what he needed to obey him. Genesis fifteen six says Abram believed the Lord. Abram believed God would do anything. Abram believed God would keep his promises. This is called faith. Abram and Sarai kept waiting. I'm sad to say that while they were waiting, they made some bad choices. Sometimes, when people believe God, they still make bad choices. Remember, God gave His people everything they need to obey Him, but sometimes we forgot to ask God for help. Sarai has a helper named Hagar. Hagar was mean to Sarah. Hagar was going to have a baby, but Sarah could not. So Hagar made fun of Sarah. Sarah began to disobey God too. Sarah was unkind to Hagar. Abram didn't help Sarah. Abram didn't help Hagar. Abram, Sarah, and Hagar were all unkind and unloving. Hagar decided to run away. Hagar packed her bag and ran down the road. It was a hot day. Hagar was tired, thirsty, and sad. God knew the trouble Sarah, Hagar, and Abram were having. God always knew where we are and what we do. God gave His people everything they need to obey Him. God is provider. God is like our father who takes special care of us. God cared for Hagar. God came to Hagar. God talked to Hagar. God told Hagar to go back to Sarah and obey her. God helped Hagar to do the right thing. God gave Hagar a promise that she would have a baby boy, and her family would be so big that she would not be able to count them. Hagar met God and heard God talk to her. Hagar knew God loved her even when she disobeyed God. God never stopped loving us even when we disobey. God sent His Son Jesus to die for us. Jesus took the punishment for the times we disobey. Jesus forgives us when we disobey and help us. Obey him when we ask. Hagar make a name for God. Hagar called the God. 
the God who sees me. God always sees us. God sees us when we are sad or need help. God loves us and help us. God gives His people everything they need to obey Him. Now I'm gonna ask you some questions. First, who gives His people everything they need to obey Him? God. Did you say God? Yes, you are right. God gave His people everything they need to obey Him. Who is our provider? God again. Yes, God is our provider. He takes care of us. He helps us. You are doing a great job. The Bible verse for this week is short, and it has strong rhythm. Abram believed the Lord. Genesis fifteen six. Now you can pause the video and go find two. Big, large markers, just like the ones I have here. We can use them as rhythm sticks. Do you have them? Now that read the Bible verse together. Abram believed the Lord. Genesis fifteen six. Abram believed that God can do anything, even give baby to very old people. Let's try very soft voice. And with very soft tapping, Abram believed the Lord. Genesis fifteen six. Abram know that God always keep his promises. Let's try this time with very fast tapping. Abram believed the Lord. Genesis fifteen six. Wow. So here is where the Bible verse. Is in the Bible. You can put your markers or rhythm sticks down and touch the verse. The Bible is God's words, and it is always true. Abram believed the Lord. Genesis fifteen six. Amen. Pick up your rhythm sticks again. We will worship God by singing. Abram trusted God will keep his promises. Let's sing trust and again while tapping our sticks. Trust and obey, for there's no other way to be happy in Jesus but to trust and obey. God give us everything we need to obey Him. We can trust and obey God. Let's sing the song again while tapping our sticks. Trust and obey, for there's no other way to be happy in Jesus but to trust and obey. God is our provider. He sees you, knows you, he loves you. He will provide you with everything you need. Let's close today's lesson while giving thanks to our God. Dear God, thank you for being our provider. Thank you for loving us and helping us, and thank you for giving us everything we need to obey you. Thank you for taking care of us. In Jesus' name, Amen.